So now we're going to talk about the major and minor arpeggios. We've done C major and C minor, G major and G minor. Now we're going to do D major, A major, and E major and minor. So we've already done the majors, but let's just kind of look at what's similar between these. So to do this, I'm just going to draw them out. So first let's talk about D major. In the key of D major, we have two sharps, F sharp, C sharp. And of course, when we're doing the arpeggios, we're just playing the one chord, which is comprised by the notes B, F sharp, A, and then just repeats. Okay, and same with the right hand. So the fingering is going to be one, two, three in the right hand, then we shift and do it again. One, two, three, five, then back down. The left hand fingering will be five, three, two, one, and then three, two, one, and then back down. And notice how the third of the chord is a black key. So you have one, two, three. So that's pretty easy to remember one. Review that with the left hand. Now to turn that into D minor, all we have to do is just make the F a natural. So it's exactly the same notes, but now we just have the natural, which means they're all white keys. The fingering can be the same. So we have D major, and let's follow it with D minor. Here's D major, one, ready, and play. One, two, three, one, two, three, five, three, two, one, three, two, one. And now we go to D minor, which has the F natural, all white keys. One, two, three, one, two, three, five, three, two, one, three, two, one. We do this also with the left hand. Let's do D major first. Ready, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One now F natural for minor. You can use fourth finger or third finger on it. Ready and play. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, one. Now the nice thing about D major, A major, and E major is they all feel the same. They feel the same because in A major, now you have the notes A, C sharp, and E. Okay, which means again the middle note is A sharp, A, C sharp, E. Okay, in the minor, it's going to be C natural, A, C natural, E, all white keys. Same thing happens on E major, E minor, E major, E, G sharp, B, the middle note is sharp, and E minor, G natural, E, G, B, all white keys. So although you're starting in different positions, the distances are identical, so they're going to feel pretty darn similar. Let's try A major with the right hand. Here we go. Second finger on C sharp, third finger on E. One, ready, and play. One, two, three. One, two, three, five. Two, three, one, two, three, one. And now we go to the minor by just moving your second finger down to C natural, all white keys. Ready, and play. One, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. And we can do also do this with the left hand. Let's try the left hand. With a C sharp, A major, ready and play. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. And now 
now just change that to a C natural, A minor, ready, and uh, play. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. And then let's go to E major with the right hand, starting on E, the middle note is G sharp, and then B. So again, the middle note is a black key, right hand, ready? Here we go. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. And now to minor, second finger goes down to G natural. Here we go. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. And now let's go to the left hand, E major. Five, three, two, one, with a G sharp. Ready? Here we go. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. And now to minor with a G natural. Ready? Here we go. Five, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, five. And a great, now that you've done that, we've, we've learned C major, C minor, G major, G minor, D, A, and E. So a great way to practice this is just to do them back to back like this. One, two, three, one, two, three, C. And then right into C minor without stopping. to G, one, two, three, one, two, three, five, three, two, G minor. So we're just doing it without a pause. You can always repeat the pairs. Then to D, here we go. Three, one, two, three, five, three, two. Then minor. to A, here we go. Then to minor. Then to E, here we go. And that's how you can practice it.